Um, the heat is on and I'm not turning it off because it's so cold. Anyway, the reason I look like I got hit by a truck is because um, I haven't gotten ready. I haven't put my makeup or, or hair together. And it doesn't get much better than this, but it does get better. I, w I wanted to start the recipe I'm going to make today. Today, day six, I think, of the eight vlogs of Hanukkah. I got it right that time. I want to make jelly donuts. Last year I made latkes, vegan latkes, so if you are interested in seeing me make vegan latkes, I honestly was going to redo it again this year, but I last, I watched my video last year and it's truly a treasure. So go watch that <laughs> if that's what you, if that's the kind of content you're looking for. Wow, I look like, <laughs> I look insanely bad. This is reality, people. I'm going to make donuts, but I have to let the yeast, um, Broth. I've never made anything with yeast. I'm really nervous slash excited because I've always kind of wanted to try it. So let's go get it done. Let's go do it. I'm using Mayan B. Alex um, recipe that you can find on PETA.com. You need a cup of warm non-dairy milk. I, the reason this is in the Starbucks container is because I stole this from work. There's non-dairy milk at work that literally only I use. So if I need it for something, I'm like, fuck yeah, I'm going to steal it. Anyway, this needs to be warm. So I'm going to put it in the microwave for like 30 seconds. Okay, I heated up the milk for, for a minute. It feels warm. Could just be the bowl that's warm. <laughs> um, she said it should be 110 degrees, but like, you know your girl is now a thermometer. I look so bad. The yeast is going in the milk with some sugar. Okay, and I'm combining them. Okay, I would say that is combined. Now I have to let that stand until foamy. So I'll see you when I'm hopefully a little bit uh, more acceptable to look at. Hello, you wanna see something gross as fuck? Oh, it's frothing, all right. Whisk together flour and salt in a bowl. All right, so in this, which is just the flour and salt, the yeast mixture, which is disgusting. Okay, now I add the egg replacer. Melted butter. I was wait for this to cool, but fuck that. Beat until the dough is soft, but not sticky. Three minutes. Wow, you know what would be great right now? If I had a KitchenAid stand mixer. Mom, I've only been asking for like the last five years. It's Hanukkah, motherfucker. It's in this. Who really needs a stand mixer when you have a boyfriend? <laughs> nope. So I have to knead this and then I have to let it sit for an hour and a half, which I did not know. And that sucks because I definitely don't have an hour and a half. But we're gonna do it anyway. See what happens. This is what happens when someone who doesn't know what they're doing tries to do something. All right, let's flower up this surface. Wow, this is addictingly fun. Wow, pro tip, if you wanna cook a lot of stuff, don't have fake nails. They really get in the way. Mary, are you asleep? If you wanna wash your hands, you can knead the dough, it's really fun. I'm not, I'm not, no! <laughs> Wasn't that fun? Mm -hmm. You're welcome for letting you doing that. I'll make pizza in there. Why you the thing? That's okay. loosely with plastic wrap. Y'all know I don't have that. That'll do, kid. Okay, it says to let it warm it, let it warm, let it rise in a warm, dry-free place. I'm gonna put it in my oven. My oven is off. It's not cooking, but it's probably warm in there and uh, no draft, you know? In order to make this work, it's not gonna be able to rise as long as it should. It says an hour and a half. I'm gonna have to do an hour just to get this done before I have to go. Like, don't listen to anything I do. It's basically the life lesson of every video I make. <laughs> we're back, am I sweating? Yeah, a little bit, but you can't really tell. Okay, we're back, it's been a little over an hour. I have to leave in 30 minutes, so can we do this in 30 minutes? Probably not, oh well. Oh, the dishwasher's running. What are you gonna do about it? Okay, has this risen at all? Yes, fun. Look at that beautiful yeasty mother Punch down the dough. Watch me get all my anger out right here, buddy. Gross. I don't have a rolling pin. Oh, she's sticky. It's been four minutes, which is basically five. So we're done with that. Okay, we're supposed to use a, a two inch cookie sheet. That looks, a uh, cookie cutter. 
This looks two inches, right? This is just the top of a mason jar. Boom, let's start cutting out these donuts. started nice and then I progressively gave less and less of a fuck as we went on. It says to use put to boil to uh, put uh, what am I trying to say? Six cups of oil in here to 375 degrees. I don't have a thermometer so I'm just gonna guess. Hope you like oil. <laughs> Holy fuck I'm only. Okay I used my friend Google to figure out how to tell when the oil is hot enough. Apparently if I drop a popcorn kernel in it when the popcorn kernel pops it's hot enough. I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. The thing I love popcorn. Okay, you see the single kernel floating? Now we wait. Yo, it popped! We ready! Come here, little popcorn kernel. One minute per side, okay? It smells like fried dough. Oh my god, I did it! Oh my god, they look great! <laughs> okay, these are pretty much ready. So cute! Hot, 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 hot. You guys, I totally forgot to update you yesterday, but my coworkers loved the donuts. I brought, I ended up coming back and filling the rest of them with jelly. And then I brought all of them to work and they were all gone in under 10 minutes. All of them. I've already had five um, regular ones, but I have to try a jelly one. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 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 Gone, and they're asking me to bring them again on Friday, so I might be remaking them. Anyway, extremely successful. I thought they were good, and I'm so glad I'm not the only one. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog, and I'm already, it's already the next day, so this is the outfit I'll be wearing tomorrow in tomorrow's vlog. Sneak peek, spoiler alert. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, and subscribe if you haven't already. See you tomorrow, aka in real life today. Okay, bye. bye.